A four-year-old girl from Strongsville, Ohio, has died after she was hospitalized for complications from a common cold that caused her to have a stroke that required emergency brain surgery. Last week, Maisie Schmidt went to the hospital for what her parents thought would be an in-and-out visit, according to a GoFundMe set up for the family. We got told it was just a common cold, just take her home, lots of fluids, and things of that nature, her father, Patrick Schmidt, told Cleveland 19, sharing that she had a stuffy nose and cough. However, Maisie got more lethargic, and they took their daughter to the hospital on March 23, where the preschooler was given a CT scan. They said that there was some bleeding on the brain, so they wanted to get a scan of that, and in the process of doing so they found that she actually had a very large stroke on the right side of her brain, Schmidt told Cleveland 19. She was diagnosed with the human metanumovirus, a virus that usually causes symptoms similar to a cold, according to the Cleveland Clinic. Patients, might cough or wheeze, have a runny nose or a sore throat. And the CDC says, it, may progress to bronchitis or pneumonia and are similar to other viruses that cause upper and lower respiratory infections. But as the GoFundMe explained, most people may exhibit cold symptoms with this virus but unfortunately it's grabbed a hold of Maisie and isn't letting go. One study published in the National Library of Medicine linked human metanumovirus to an increased risk of stroke, but only for the elderly. And the Cleveland Clinic explains that, the peak age for severe illness from HMPV is between 6 and 12 months. According to the GoFundMe, Maisie underwent brain surgery, to remove a large section of her cranium to relieve cranial pressure as well as part of her brain. The part of her brain that was removed usually serves of no significance and shouldn't affect any crucial functions after recovery. We just thought it was a common cold and that we'd be taking her home the same day, her father told Cleveland 19. But on March 26 at 11 a.m., Maisie was removed from life support. There was simply nothing more that could be done, her family told Cleveland 19. Thank you for the support and opportunity to share her story. And as the GoFundMe shared, she wanted everyone to just be happy. So here it goes Maisie. I promise to give it my all to focus on only the positive things in life.